What's up, everyone? Another void back with more Factorio for you. Episode 207. Um, I've been running around the base already this morning, kind of checking stuff out, seeing what we need. We've got a lot of work to do. A few fixes I want to put in before we get going on the next steps. And we really have to fix our solar panel issue because we have brownouts. Because we have all those drills running up north, now we have brownouts. So we got to fix that right away. So the first thing I want to do is uh, is get some fixes going. One thing we need to do, why are we not in the car? Especially going over train tracks, the car at least keeps us safe. Oh, get in the car. Is uh, we need to resupply our little manual battery thing, and I want to open it up to make, so it'll make more than 200 at a time, because 200 batteries is nothing. So let's grab some more plastic here to so resupply that guy. Now there's no plastic coming in because we don't have the gas that we need, so we're gonna have to fix that in a minute too. But I wanted to get this uh, battery thing resupplied. We need plastic and we need lead plate. See, there are brownouts happening right now. So while we have brownouts, our, we're basically defenseless. Our base is defenseless. Now, luckily, the area up north is run with guns, so those are always on. They don't, they don't have a power requirement. Um, but our main base is completely open to hostilities, right? So we also are going to need some of this. We've got tons. Okay, good. Let's go back this direction. I'm also going to drop off some of this plate. We don't really need it. Um, should I put it in here? We don't need all this iron plate. Um, I thought we would need it, but we don't. So, there we go. Alright, so we've got this going. I think there was something else I wanted to do, too. But let's just drop this stuff off in here. Lots of lead plate. All the plastic you could ever want. Nickel ore is what we kind of need, so let's get some of that. Let's also tell this guy that you can make, let's say 600 batteries, because we're going to need tons of these batteries. We're going to start producing um, accumulators, and they take five batteries apiece. So, wait, where's the... is this it? Okay, well, let's bump this to 600. That's three stacks. And that should help us out a lot, because we're going to set up a manual um, accumulator, and, oh, we're going to have to get out of this, because there's no... This is supposed to be the freeway in here, and it got borked over by the solar. Wow, that's good driving right there. Let's get, let's get some nickel... Right? Let's just get a bunch so that we can just give that dude a whole ton. We're going to fill that guy in. And then we are going to start... We're going to work on a couple of other things that I noticed really, really fast. Then we will get back to creating solar panels and accumulators. Um, I might set that up first. I'm going to set it right up here, right next to the power uh, stuff we have going right here. And so it'll be really easy to transfer these batteries over. It'll be no-brainer. Uh, but we will do that we got to get away from... What I want to do is get away from this manual processing we keep doing. We don't have to do this. Um, it should be... What do I want with that? It should be a lot easier to do this. It shouldn't be that big of a deal. Okay. We also need L0 chipsets. Looks like we're kind of running out. Because we need to expand our base. We need laser turrets as well. So we, need, we just need batteries. A lot of batteries. Uh, I also wanted to cut this off. But, oh, we don't have that. I want to get rid of that chunk. One thing I can do here is do this. Oh, I can't. Can I put it in here, maybe? Nope. Those are full. And I'm sure it won't go in... Well, it might go in here. Nope, those are full as well. Everything's full. Alright, well, I guess I'll just put it in here. And crushed stone can go... I don't know, here's probably fine. It won't fit here. And I'm going to turn these off. There we go. Because I don't want... I mean, I we do need some silicon, but I don't know how much we really need. We're not producing a lot of chipsets right now. And I want this guy to back up a tiny bit. I want to make sure we have tin. Tin is more important than silicon. Alright, so I've done that. I've done that... Now I'm going to make the solar panel and accumulator kind of um, manual factories over here. Again, I want to stay away from doing this a lot. Uh, it's just a kind of a good idea for right now because we need these and I don't want to build them by hand. So let's look at how we're going to build these. Steel plate, L1s, and copper plates. Really, really simple. Let's build that first. And we'll just do it with this iron chest. I guess we'll just do it over here. Let's try to keep it close to this so that I don't have too many things 
like in the way when I want to drive around. I really should move this. It's not a bad idea. Why don't we do this? Uh, nope. Seriously, put all the stuff in there. Okay. Okay. Now I'm just going to copy this. And then move it. Cool. So now I think I can just strip it out. Let's put uh, let's put down one of these guys, and then hopefully they all the robots will stay close by because that would suck if they didn't. I don't want to go chasing these guys around. All right, so now I'm gonna move this first. Let me put this down. That looks good. Hopefully they, they will put it directly there, but we will see. Because I want to move that a little closer to over here. Okay, good. Uh, 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 see? What are you doing? Well, at least they're pretty close. Okay, so now I'm going to pop that down over here. That looks good. And then this stuff and just go in here. I guess, or something. Okay. Now, we should be able to build this guy, but I'm going to move this. It's a little close, I guess. To there. Okay. Alright, so let's build this. What are we going to need here? What are we going to need? Steel... L1s and copper. No big deal. Steel, L1s and copper. I'm going to put this on one side. Well, what are we going to need for accumulators? Uh, accumulators. I'm just going to build the regular ones for now. Just iron plate and batteries, huh? So I think we can do... We should be able to get away with one iron chest. Although iron chests are pretty tiny. So we'll do it on opposite sides. And we'll, we'll try to have it meet in the middle. Okay? So we're going to do... I think two of these would probably be fine. Right? We don't need more than two. This will make... Uh, how fast do these make? These get created? Ten seconds? Oh, well, this is just gonna... Do, this is just gonna work, because I don't care. I'm just gonna make it work. Alright, so... You're gonna pick up from over here. Uh, pick up tiles there. And we'll give you some power... And maybe some light. Oops. All right. Then you're going to dump into this guy here, which everybody's going to use this. So just like the other setup we have. And your drop position is there. We'll just keep doing this because it seems like it's a good idea. This is not very efficient. I don't really care. Okay. So in this one, we need steel. Well, let's pick this up. Steel. Copper. Uh, is it copper? Yep, and L1s. There we go. Now we're making these guys, so we also need to say... You guys... Need to know... Like, I only want you to... Well, no, let's do it this way. Let's do it this way. I'm gonna do it from here. When you have... Wait, it's doing it again. <laughs> Actually, that'll work. Let's just uh, wire these up. Oops, that's the wrong direction. We're going to wire it from here. Okay, there we go. So, we're going to say, what are these stack in? I think it's 50 or something. I don't know. Wow, they're really slow. Maybe I should make more. That is extremely slow. How many panels do we need per? Is it in this one? 16 panels makes one of those grids. That's really, really slow. Well, we could... No, nah, we'll just keep it like this. We're going to keep it like this. It should be fine. I want to see how many we can make of these. And we don't really care. We're just going to do it that way. Okay, so we're going to say when you have, I'm going to say less than 100. 
when you have less than 100 uh, medium dudes here, right? Medium solar panels, you can go. But you need to pick up from there. Okay. So what's the ratio? Oh, wow. 14 L1s. Okay, so we need tons of L1s. Let's go get a bunch more. And we don't... What do we need for? Accumulator's just battery and, and iron plate, right? So that's going to be easy. Why don't we pick up some steel, other, other materials at the same time. Some iron plate, some copper. We'll put that in there. Plus we need some for ourselves. Some steel, L1 chipsets, probably a ton of those. Like, tons and tons. Tin is not started yet. We will get to that in a second. Just wanted to get this build working. And then we can work on that in a minute. We also need L zeros. Let's go pick it for, for ourselves, because we're running out of those. We need we need a... Uh, is that supposed to be my freeway? I think so. Yeah, we're going to need, like... Like a lot. And we're going to need one of these. In fact, that's how many of these we're going to need. So now that thing's going to go crazy. Our L1s are just going to go nuts. Which means our L0s are also going to go nuts, because L1s require L0s, so... There you go with that. Okay, so let's get back over here, finish this build up, which we're almost done with. Really, we're just filling in crap. Mostly we need these. I don't even think we need anything. Well, we'll put a little bit of that in there, because I got a little extra. But that's really it. We don't need that many of those. It's only four each of those, but it's 14 of these chipsets. In fact, I'm just going to put them all in. I'll go get some more. All right, that's done. Now let's create one for accumulators. Same setup. Really, really, really simple. And we're going to go get some more. These dudes. Where are they? Where are they going to edit? it? Uh, right there. Nope. Is it over here? Like right there, I think. And... Okay, he needs... Okay, we should be able to do that. I think we're good. Maybe we'll put a little, a couple of plates in here. And then I think we need to put plates in here as well. Uh, let's go check this out. I think something's wrong with our manual thing over here. We also have a lot of things connected to that. This is just kind of a mess, but, but it's because a lot of these builds kind of help each other out. So I kind of think this build is not working. It's just steel? I think we're missing stone. Maybe some plate? Yeah, we're missing plate. Okay, I need a plate. Like, a lot of it. Let's just put all the plate in there and we'll get more. Because we were not making gears, which I need gears too, so let's go get some gears. Alright, I think that's good to go. I think. Yep, as you can see, Bob Monium eating it up like it's going out of style. There we go. Iron, iron's probably just jamming out too. We have a lot of problems coming up. Okay, so we've got more inserters, which is good. Uh, drop off tile there. Totally fine. Now, we are going to do the same thing over here, basically. We're going to just do that. Pick up position here. Same thing. Uh, we're not going to power those yet because I want to get them wired real quick. Well, I do need to power them because i that's where I'm doing the wiring, right? Okay. So we're going to say U to here, just like we did previously. And we're going to say when you have less than 100 accumulators, although we don't need as many accumulators, but it's not that big a deal. Less than 100 accumulators, then go which is right now. This guy should be going there. <clears throat> Excuse me. All right, now we can set these up to do accumulators. And we only need batteries and iron, I think. There we go. What's the ratio? Two to five, okay. So that's probably enough iron. Let's go get more batteries much as we can possibly handle. 
There we go. All right. That should be a good stockpile of batteries. I mean, it's not really good, but it's it'll get us there. It's going to get us there anyway. How fast do we... Oh, good. 41. We're making these pretty quick, actually. This is also a really, really slow process, but that's okay. Let's now go to the next thing. So I re resupplied the manual battery factory. I also created the accumulator and panel manual area. So we're going to... We'll deal with that in a minute. Let's go turn on... Because remember, we never turned on the tin or supply train to the to the tin forge, so the tin forge is not doing anything. I was waiting for enough to pile up so the train wouldn't sit in there. I don't think we're going to get away from that. I think we're, the train's just going to sit in there. It's going to create clogs till this guy has till he has twenty thousand. So right now, I know we don't have near that much. Let's go fix the, the ore supply first. The, the tin ore. I want to speed it up. It's just not going fast enough, so I'm going to speed the um, sorters up. So, let's look at... we. It needs 20k, so until it has 20k, until we have 20k in this storage area, we shouldn't turn it on. And we need more than 20k. Well, not we don't have to have 20k. Okay, so there's our turrets going off up north, which I checked on to completely fine. We've got 9,000 right now. So we're going to upgrade these we're going to upgrade this area over here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to pick these up and we're going to create L3 sorters. So you can see to create L2s, you need the previous sorting facility. Um, I would have picked them all up except I don't want to copy that recipe back down. Just, just like kind of a, kind of a, um, what's that called? A little bit of laziness there. So we're getting brownouts again. Let's create, let's create these really quickly. So this also uh, takes L2 chipsets to create the, L the L2s. These L2 sorters take L2 chipsets. And aluminum plate, which I, we do have some. Let's make two of those. We'll plop them back down and turn them onto 10. Now the problem I think we might have is we might not be able to supply and unload fast enough now. Because these guys are twice as fast as the L0s. So we will see if we'll be able to supply these fast enough. I kind of doubt it. So obviously they're not doing anything. But let's get this in there real quick. So we don't have any issues. See, we're going to have issues with that stuff. In fact, let's turn off the supply so that we can uh, get rid of our crap that we have. So now I'll pick this guy up. We'll make another L3 real quick. And then I'm going to see if that's all we need. I was going to make a fourth one. Well, I probably should anyway, because we're here, and it doesn't cost that much to make. They're not that expensive. Um, then we'll have maximum capacity, right? So, our problem is, we're just now getting our power back, and it's just not all the way online, so it's slow. Everything slows down when you don't have enough power. So my problem is, I think the output, it's just not going to be able to keep up. So now to see it's at full blast, look how much output we've got. Look at the output. It's just crazy. See, it's full. So we can't even keep up now. Well, it's, it seems to be keeping up. But see, not here. It's backing up. So that means we need to speed up the outbound. So let's do, let's do that. Which means we're going to have to upgrade all of these. Honestly, we probably don't need to upgrade back here. But let's do it anyway. Like we're, I mean, we're upgrading this whole thing. We might as well just do the whole thing. All right. So we've got that going. That's faster. Now we just need to fat speed up all of this. And now it'll actually be able to keep up. The problem is going to be upgrading all these undergrounds as well. Right, and we got we, the whole thing. We have to upgrade this whole line. This 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 entire belt system has to be upgraded. So let me just do this. For now. We're gonna upgrade all these, and then we'll get to the undergrounds. In fact, let's make some underground while we wait. I can only make one. Fifty-seven plate to make that. I'm out of plate. Well, I guess let's go get some. 
Come on. That squeeze through is awesome. That little uh, dude. So are we out? We are. There, we'll do that. We'll turn this back on. Uh, now I don't think the supply is going to be fast enough. We might have to upgrade the supply as well. It's a little easier. It's just belt. Not a big deal. Um, ooh, let's, let's fix this. Uh, let's do this, too. Let's fix this guy. We forgot to do it. There we go. All right, I think we're good. Pick this back up. All right, cool. So what do I need? Iron plate? Yes, because i got to make gears and stuff. And I don't want to manually make those gears, but I guess I don't have a choice. Let's go refill the gear area. I'm going to go steal those gears. They're going to need way more than that, probably. Our iron is just going to... is getting... Uh, well, I don't want to say the word, but you know what I mean. All right, what do we got here? Accumulators having a hard time. They have batteries. They just take forever to make. Okay. We can make tier three. Um, can't we make tier three of these? Let's replace those with a couple tier threes. Because we need speed. Speed is our friend right here. All right, let's steal the gears, which I don't even know. Good, we do. Okay, let's steal those gears. Make some undergrounds. We don't need that many, probably. We'll make, like, ten, because remember, it duplicates them. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. There we go. Okay, so we're good to go there. I do still have iron plate. Okay, so we're good. Also, we have two of these. Upgraded. Those are qu quite a bit faster, noticeably faster. Assembly machine threes. The thing is, though, they eat a lot of resources, so you got to be careful. A lot of power, I mean. Right now we're having power problems, so. Alright, so let's continue to upgrade this system. Looks like it's no problems now if we do this upgrade. Alright, so I think I stopped here. And this is going to be great for us. This is going to guarantee that we really kind of don't have any tin issues as far as again because we have to unscrew this whole area and then we're going to need a fast here and more underground or more regular or fast bolt and a fast loader wow I'm making L1s okay I need to go get some L1s. That's right, I gave them all to the uh, accumulator thing, huh? Or no, the... Um, the uh, solar panel thing. There we go. Okay, so... Let's put the tin ore in there. I don't want that. Where'd it go? That's iron ore, dude. Cool, now we're making it faster. But we still have an issue with the underground, so let's do that real quick. Tons of undergrounds, obviously. Oh, I can... Okay, that's... Okay, good. I don't... What am I doing? I didn't know I could do that, actually. Jesus, I should have just left it all underground, but I, I guess with the L, L0s, you can't. Because they don't have very much reach. Their reach is only four, right? There. Okay, so output is upgraded. Good. We are not... Our output is not... Uh, is no longer the bottleneck. Now we need to turn that train on because the thing is going to fill up. Which I guess is fine. We're fine with that. We have something to stop it. Now let's... Can we keep up with supply? No. So now we need to upgrade our supply. Which we might as well just do like this. Go backward, right? Work our way backward. But we also need to do the underground. So let's make a couple more. We're also going to need to do those splitters, which I don't think we have any more splitters. All right, let's make some more splitters. Basic electron. Oh, we're going to go get some of those L1s. No, we'll just make them. Two, three, four. One, two, three. Yeah, one, two, three. Okay. What is this? Oh, we need... Do we need something to pull these out faster? We do. So we need uh, one, two, three unloaders, and this guy, I don't know why he's been detached. 
But he was. All these are detached. Why? Well, no wonder we're not getting any output. I'm not even sure if we're going to be able to keep up with the output since he's got detached. But I think, I think the L0 unloaders will be fast enough. I don't think we need two of those. Okay, so we've got these guys now. These splitters. Right? Now we need to upgrade the, this area. And I think we're going to have to have fast load here. So we need three of these, which we already have. And then I think we can do this. There we go. Okay, so we've upgraded this, but we, we still need to do a couple things down here. Oh, right there. And we're going to have to upgrade this as well. All right. Closer, getting closer. There we go. All right, so that's faster. There, nice. Okay. Bobmonium is faster. We're running out. All right, we need more fast belt. But we're almost there. There's only a little bit more to go, and, we, and this whole system will be faster. And we're going to need more of, the, more of these guys. We need the basic chipsets, though. Uh, what do we need? Fast belt. There we go. How's this guy doing? He's doing all right. How's this guy doing? Not the greatest. I still have tons of... Okay, I'm, I'm not going to be gluttonous. I'm not going to steal those... I'm not going to steal the gears, even though I should. It's fun. <laughs> Let's get some more L L1s or whatever. Oh, we only have three minutes, huh? L1 chipsets. How are we doing over here? We need more L1 chipsets. We, we ran out. But we have more than 100. It should have stopped. So when I put some in there, it should stop. So... Oh, with this, we're out of batteries. Yeah, we're out of batteries. Let's resupply the batteries, if we have any anyway. We should. Well, that's an okay amount. There we go. That'll get those accumulators going again. How are we on iron? We're good. Yeah, we just need the L1s. Also going to make some red wire while we're at it, because we're just kind of chilling out right now. Let's get another 1,000 L1s, I think. Cool, it's already done. Maybe like that many, because I'm going to need some for myself. That should make this thing go ballistic again. Okay. All the components fire off. Everything fires off. Tons of gas stuff. Elect like liquid things. Like, those chipsets have a huge supply chain. So when you take a 1,000 of those out like that, it's, it's going to hurt. It's going to hit. Your system's going to take a hit. Hopefully you have enough power to deal with it, which we don't right now. That's a big problem, right? There we go. There's five of those. Let's make some splitters. Let's make five of them, I guess. And then let's work on the rest of this supply chain here. This is fast belt, right? I think. Well, the only one way to find out. Oops, nope. We don't want that. It's this. I think all this is fast built. Yeah, okay. Alright, so... There we go. The fast unloader will help us there. This one, this uh, Bobmonium chunks is a little bit uh, longer of a supply chain, so it'll be a little bit harder. Let's make a couple of these guys. We're going to need fast unloaders for this, so they can keep up. And the Bobmonium one is here. Okay, good. Okay, so we've already got fast undergrounds right here, so we really, oh, we're almost done with the Bobmonium one. There we go. Why is it stopped? It's stopped. It shouldn't be stopped, unless we uh, don't need tin ore anymore. That makes sense, I guess. Let's go look. It's full. 
Okay, well that's good. That means we have 20,000. No. Something's broken. It's this guy right here. I think. Oh, no, it's turned it off. What's what's this thing set at? 15? No way. These things will do 20k, I, I believe. So let's put this up to 20. Alright, you should be flowing, man. The spice must flow. Hurry up. There we go. Yeah, this thing can hold way more than that. Alright, so now we're moving again. Let's see if we're keeping up. Pretty good. I mean, we're doing pretty good. I think it's our, our exit is... We need the next level belt to really make it move faster. We might be able to do it. I, th I think that's a good rate. That's a good rate right there. So let's go turn the train on now, because we've got 15,000. It's going to take a while for that thing to load and unload and all that, so we should be fine. We're a little over the time, but that's okay. Fixed our 10. We finally have 10. Now we don't have to worry about 10. We can just worry about power now. And I think our power issues are not that bad. I think we're going to be fine. Turn this guy back to automatic. Let's go watch him load up. We might, I might switch those to fast loaders too, so these trains aren't sitting in there just trying to. Let's see. There we go. Get those prepped. I want to get that train in and out as fast as possible because we have this problem with the ore area here. All right. There, now the belt. Is that the correct direction? There we go. There we go. That's much better, much better. So now we've got 10. Awesome. That didn't take very long, actually. Super, super awesome. In fact, I really... You know what? Let's help fill this thing, just so we can get this thing moving, because I want to do it on camera. There we go. No path. Why not? Why can't it go to the forge, the tin forge? That's really strange. I also need to dump off these chunks. This is why this whole area is just kind of messed up. Oh, it needs one of these probably. Uh, but let's try to get. No, that's not the right one. Let's... Can we can we get this in in there? That's what she said. I think we can. All right, let's try to. Nope. The bombonium is the one that can't keep up. It's interesting. Let's cut the supply off for a sec. Oh, it's putting in the wrong crap. That's going to be fun to fix. Well, we need to fix this path issue. So I need to put a little signal thing down in here to split this up. And there's nowhere to put it. Super awesome. There is literally... Well, now there is, because I can take that out. So I think that's all I need to do. I'll take this out. This should still go to that, right? There we go. Now I should be able to put in one of these right here. And it should have a path now. We should be able to manually tell it to go here. It, it can't? I'll just drive it. Why won't it go? Nothing is in the way. What's in the way? Nothing. I don't know. Everything looks fine to me. I don't know why this would be a big problem. Can I drive it the other direction? Can't do anything. Oh, yeah, I can. Go. So, hopefully, I just kind of fixed everything. Now I should be able to turn it back to manual. Let's get out of it. There, just... Why can't it go there? What's wrong with the tin thing? Something's up with this tin thing. So this is Demand Forge tin. Is that not what it's called anymore? It's very, it's very possible. <laughs> well, this is an extra long video. 
Because I just have to get this fixed. There's no way I can cut in the middle of trying to fix this. I'll forget what I was doing. This thing is called Demand Forge 10. Demand Forge 10. What's wrong here? I don't see a problem. Hmm. No path. I think there's I think this is fine, but we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna fix this. Demand Forge 10. Let's just get back in here. Manual. Let's do this, guys. Turn, thank you. Alright, now I should from here be able to tell it to do it, right? Why can't it go there? I don't understand. Why why is it not? Alright, well we'll just drive it in there for now. Alright, now can it go in? Now I can. Okay, well it's that's good. There we go. Now we have tin. We will have new tin plate, which we probably already have things that need it, so it's gonna be a while before the tin backs up on its own. Um, and then we need to fix this other area. We'll have to do that in episode um whoa oh oh episode three oh or two oh eight. We need to fix this sorting area over here. Cause it's got the wrong stuff in it. I don't know why. It must have switched the filtering. Which I think is gonna happen on the other side too. I thought it would keep it. But apparently it reset it. So let's just go fix that. We're almost here. I'll, I'm going to fix the actual issue in a little bit. But this has no filtering now. So if we go to this. Yeah, crushed duratite. Okay. And the same thing over here. Crushed bobmonium. We should be good now. I'm going to fix that on the next episode. Stay tuned for that. Uh, extra long video for you. And as always, stay frosty.